Hello everybody. Welcome back. In today's video I will show you how to create a server time or let's say a time benchmark for your app. This date and time can't be changed, even if the user changed the date and time of their phone. Also, this date and time will be the same in every time zone. Let's start. First, go to pub.dev and search for NTP. Add it to your pubspook.yaml. Now, let me create a screen and then I will explain it to you. Here you can see how date time now shows a date and time in the app. It shows the same date and time as the phone. If the user changes date and time in their phone settings, date time now will also change. This is not good for some app that uses a countdown to certain time. The user will time travel to the change time. Now let's use NTP to show date and time. NTP will show the real time according to the phone's time zone. Let's try to change the date and time. As you can see here, we still be able to get the correct date and time, even if I change date and time in the settings. As you probably already noticed, this box shows real time in UTC. NTP is able to get the correct time. But, if I change the phone's time zone, the time provided by NTP will also change leaving only the minutes and the seconds correct. Now we need to centralize this time, using only one time zone for every user. We will use UTC as the server time, just add to UTC after NTP time and you are all set. Now we got server time. A same date and time for every user of the app. The server time will not change, even if the date and time or the time zone of the phone is changed. Showing the server time will likely confuse the user with a different time zone. So we can show local time to the user. Simply replace to UTC to to local after NTP time. Or you can show NTP time since it's the same time as the local time zone. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you learned something new from my videos. If you have any question, feel free to leave it in the comments section below. As always, the source code will be available in the description. 
See you in the next one. Bye bye.